So Logan, here for media day today. How does it finally feel to be here at Derbyshire now? Feels really good. It's been a few months kind of waiting for to arrive in, in Derby and it's really cool to meet all the guys and, and meet the staff and, and you know, take a few photos as well. And obviously there's an experienced bowling pack you'll be working with the likes of Barry Rampour and Tony Pandian. You must be excited to work with top professionals like that. Yeah, for sure. It's, it's quite cool. We're all in the same corner of the, the changing room so that I'm sure we'll have a lot of uh, chats about cricket and, and uh, I'm sure we'll be quite sore at moments as well but uh, no, I'm looking forward to learning off those guys. And obviously with a new coaching setup here at Derbyshire this year with Dave Howard and Steve Kirby, lots of knowledge to gain here at Derbyshire, so you must be relishing the opportunity to learn off them. That's it, yeah. It's going to be a big year of learning and hopefully I can contribute with performances on the field, but also just, just off the field, just talking about cricket and, and really trying to get some gems from them. So what are your ambitions this season for Derbyshire now? Well, I've just heard that you know there's three teams going up to the Division 1 this year. Uh, so that would be the main goal, just to, to get into Division 1 and, and obviously have a few uh, good performances, winning matches for, for Derbyshire, but definitely to get into that Division 1. You've got lots of international experience with Holland and you're pressing to try and get some international honours with the Black Caps for New Zealand, so how do you think you'd be able to use this experience with Derbyshire to push yourself towards that? Uh, well, plenty of cricket. I think in New Zealand we don't, get, we don't play as much cricket, whereas here in, uh, in county cricket you play you know, non-stop. Uh, cricket and I'll be really looking forward to trying to score some runs and I think that's going to get me to the next level is, is being able to become that genuine all-rounder uh, so to send the opportunity to, to bat and, uh, and as well take a few wickets uh, and then hopefully we'll get back into my season in New Zealand with a uh, bit of momentum and, and, try and try and go from there. And do you think that international experience and experience abroad will help you here at Derbyshire in England now? Yeah I think there'll be moments in, in games and during the year that you know I've experienced in different competitions and uh, in different conditions as well so hopefully I can use that experience and and help the guys as well to, to try and uh, get out of those tough moments. And how, how has it been so far? How, have you enjoyed your experience here at Derbyshire? Yeah it's been really good. It's, uh, it's a lot of names so that's going to take a few uh, a few weeks to kind of get them all, all nailed but uh, really everyone's been super nice and, and just really welcoming and um, yeah it's nice to actually put on the Derbyshire kit and and, uh, and nearly soon to get into it.